Hey, what's up, guys? Um, sitting at about 36 hours in, and it's starting to hit pretty good now. I uh, drove home from work the whole way with uh, you know sweat beating on my face, and I have an undershirt that's under here that's probably been soaked with sweat right now. So it's really just the temperature swings. I'm kind of feeling like you know. I get, I feel like this surge of heat coming up over my body and then it kind of goes over the top of my head and then I kind of sweat for five minutes and then, uh, and then two minutes later I'm cold because I'm in, you know, it turns into a cold sweat. But other than that, that's pretty much it. Here, let me get this guy for you. This guy's freaking out. He's Bernie. Of course, I didn't want a cat. It's one of those situations where, uh, my fiance got a cat. I didn't want anything to do with it because I'm allergic and oh because of course he's obsessed with me now and comes running to me every time I come home and we're hetero life mates but uh <laughs> but like me mentally I'm doing great I don't know this, this one like feels very very different because uh I'm not having the the fight in my head like basically what it comes down to is that is the drugs are off the table and so I'm not having to deal with like this internal struggle of like, you know, will I, won't I, you know, when does a shop open, counting minutes and all this stuff. I'm not doing any of that this time. I'm just totally accepting uh, um, where I'm at with this. And I'm just kind of allowing it to to go through me. Um, dealing with like that, you know, it's really strange. And one of the things I always struggle with is like this mouth feel of withdrawal where it's like it, my jaw locks or something. If it, 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 it my mouth is basically, it feels like it's stuck in a position like I want to vomit, but like I'm not going to throw up. My stomach feels fine, actually. So, so far, so good. Um, I'll check back in with you guys in the morning. As far as like how I'm going to go sleep, I, I have no idea. I'll take the, he the helper meds and some, some uh, CBD, and then uh, I, I left in another room. I made some chamomile tea, and uh, we'll see how it goes. Keep pounding water. The thing I was going to bring up, I kind of, uh, one of the things that I bought this, this time around, I haven't needed it yet, but in case I do need it in the future, I think it's actually going to be great. It's one of those, like, those, uh, like, massage guns. This one was, like, like 50 bucks off of Amazon, and all the reviews are really good, and, and this is, like, this is, it, it feels like a mag light. This is, like, heavy duty. I think it's, like, Comfier or whatever, like, you know, it's going to be backwards, but, you know, if anybody's, uh, interested in going through restless legs and all that stuff. I plan on, if I do start kicking, I plan on kind of just beating on my thighs and my calves and all that stuff with that, just in case, so. Um, gosh, I, I don't know. I, I was I, When I first started this thing, I was going to be like, well, this is going to be some real kind of, uh, you know, detox struggle porn for people. You know, the people that watch other people just be miserable, but I can't give that to you yet because I'm not miserable. I actually feel pretty good. Um, I've had some great conversations with some people that have been watching the videos and uh, staying in touch uh, with friends. I called my sponsor today for the first time in maybe two months. I talked to him. It was actually a very emotional conversation. Um, and maybe I'll maybe I'll uh, uh, talk about the details of that at some point. I kind of just want to stay that to stay between me and him now. But I, I should have been calling him more. That's just what the, <laughs> that's the gist of it. Um, you know, when you're an active using, you, you just don't want to even, uh, there's almost like shame built into dealing with 12 steps and you don't want to let people down and you don't want to keep going back into the rooms, failing again. And I finally just kind of gave into that and started to disconnect from the program. But, you know, that's going to be different. I'll be calling them tomorrow and be picking that up. It's, uh, I mean, it's basically every, every tool I can get right now. I mean, this is, this is going to be the thick of it. So support groups 12-step groups therapy exercise friends and family and whatever it takes just get through it I, and I, I i think i I have access to all those tools so i really should um, be able to get through this I and mean, right now i feel like pretty good about getting through it uh it's just mentally this is just this this is so much more calm and and, and uh clearer than it, than it ever has been before usually at this point when i'm starting to like really start sweating on and off i'm starting to uh, kind of you get this that kind of internal panic feeling a little bit like you know your body's like really figuring out that something's very wrong here and it kind of starts wigging out in the past man that used to be like torturous for me and I 
uh, you know, I'd be driving down the road, either going to work or leaving work, and be like, oh, should I, should I stop today? Should I go to that head shop? Should I stop? Should I, should I, should I stop at that smoke shop? Well, you know, I can, well, I stopped, I passed that one, but I know I still got this one. Maybe I should do it. And you're kind of changing lanes back and forth, and then you just get sucked into the shop like it's a black hole. Like you don't even know how you got there, you know? But I'm not, as of right now, I don't feel any of that. I, I mean, I drove home, drove past shops. I, I know there's a gas station that has 24 hour, uh, uh, that's open 24 hours that has extract bills and uh you know and shots drove right by it as of right now it's not on the table i hope i hope this feeling really stays with me i'm gonna have to kind of th i think i'm gonna have to fight this to keep this feeling but uh so far so good and uh i'll be uh checking in with you guys probably a little bit after i wake up tomorrow much peace and love you